People living in East Palestine, Ohio, and part of Darlington Township in Beaver County have been out of their homes for days now. This is all due to that dangerous train derailment, but answers may soon be coming. Chris DeRose joining us live near the derailment site with what we're expecting today. Chris. Lindsay, David, good morning. Yeah, we are waiting to hear from crews here in East Palestine, Ohio, not only about the derailment and the cleanup efforts that are underway, but we also want to know basically when the folks who were evacuated can potentially get back into their homes. Now, right now, monitoring of this massive derailment remains in place, and that happened Friday night quickly leading to a huge chemical fire. People living nearby were forced to evacuate Friday and Saturday, and emergency crews from several states are working around the clock to secure the scene. The National Transportation Safety Board is also on site, and they are investigating. Now, as of last night, the EPA says that the air quality samples taken during and after the controlled burn do not show a threat, and the controlled release was successful. Once the Ohio Department of Health, the United States Environmental Protection Agency, in conjunction with the East Palestine Fire Department and Norfolk Southern Railroad, have determined that this is safe for East Palestine residents to return to their homes. And quite frankly, once I feel it's safe for my family to return, we will lift that evacuation order and start returning people home. Now, one other point of note, the Ohio EPA is still monitoring water quality for the surrounding areas. Right now, they're saying drinking water and groundwater are still safe, but again, they are continuing to monitor. And we, of course, are going to keep you up to date both on air and online. No word yet on when residents can return home, but we are hopeful to get an answer on that uh, later this morning. We'll keep you up to date. For now, reporting in East Palestine, Ohio, Chris DeRose, KDKA News.